Hello everybody, Andrea Trowski here with Dental Well Tutoring. So if you are taking your exam soon, in the next couple weeks, the next month even, the next couple of days, you might be wondering, well, what should I study at this point, okay? Because there is such a thing as studying too much, but there's also such a thing as studying not enough. Now, if you're worried that you haven't studied enough at this point, well, it's kind of too late because you have a couple weeks left or a month left. Like you should at this point feel fairly confident about what you know and what you don't know. Now, what I always tell my students is to study the mock exams at least a month before, because mock exams are the best way to know if you know a topic or not. Like, let's say you're taking a mock exam on um, uh, pharmacology. If you do horrible on that mock exam, then that's telling you that you don't know enough about pharmacology. So then you need to go back to your unit on pharmacology and study, study, study. But I'm not talking studying for a couple hours. I'm talking for the next day or two to be studying only pharmacology. So then the next time you take that mock exam, you should do excellent. Because let's say you take a mock exam on oral pathology and you do amazing. Well, that's telling you that you don't have to look at oral pathology anymore because you know oral pathology. And I find that if you don't take the mock exams, do you really know if you know something good enough? Possibly not. So that's why I'd say that the mock exams are the best way to study if you don't have a lot of time left because you likely still need to study certain things, but there's no sense studying a topic if you know it. There's no point, right? Don't waste your time. So you should be studying a topic that you're not comfortable with or you don't feel confident in. Now, if you're either um, a board exam prep academy member or a dental L student member, you have all of the mock exams um, pretty much there. So you do not have to purchase anything else. But if you're not a member of um, um, Dental L yet, you can still purchase um, the mock exams if you want to. Now, I'll take you guys to the website here. Let me just share my screen um, if this is something that you're interested in. So if you go to um, dentalL.com slash mock dash exams, so right up here, then I have all of them here for you per topic. So if you're thinking, okay, I would like to study a community mock exam, you, you just have to click and then read what the mock exam has because they're all a little bit different. I believe this one is a longer one. Um, it includes a PowerPoint as well, um, $60 in total, and that's it. So it depends on kind of what you wanna study. If you wanna study a little bit of, of everything, then it makes sense to get a full mock exam package here. So let's say you are a dental assisting student and you're thinking, okay, I don't know what I, I don't know, so I want to study a little bit of everything. So then you would like the full mock exam package here, so you just have to click that, and you will read some more info on it. And hey, you guys, it's on sale right now for $6. I believe I did the sale for the end of the year. It's the, it's the beginning of the year, but it's still on sale, so why not? 99 questions included, so that's a great price, obviously. Um, and for the dental hygiene exam, the same thing. I don't know if that one's on sale, to be honest. Let me take a look. But I'll tell you what, if you're watching the video and you want to look at this, um, it includes 50 questions for this one. Let me know and I will knock it down to $6. So if you want the dental hygiene one, I will knock that down for everybody who's watching the video. Just um, comment below so I know who you are and then I'll send you the link for the one that's only $6. Why not, right? Um, because as I said, if you're um, a Dental L member, you have all of these mock exams anyway. You have all of them plus more. Because if you're a member, I usually upload two new mock exams a week, sometimes every two weeks, depending on the week. With the holidays, I took a week off, so there's no new mock exams there. But I did just upload a new mock exam on TMJ today. Um, before the holidays, I uploaded one on pharmacology, so there's tons there. And typically... Um, like there's just tons, there's tons of questions, tons of topics, you have everything. But that's what I do suggest doing is looking at the mock exams if you are, if you don't have a lot of time left to study, because then at least you know that if you need to focus on a certain topic, then you should focus on that topic and nothing else. So if you guys need anything, just let me know. I hope this helped. If you need help, just um, comment below and let me know and I'd be more than happy to help you out. Bye guys, see you soon.